think? You think the chances of this unit running for the few minutes we spent are good or bad? Probably should have checked the capacitor before I changed the contactor, huh? Well, no, I know they needed a new one and I know they're gonna need a new fan motor regardless. So let's see if it pops on. But I'm at a, at a storage facility. I have two systems down, these splits right here. Um, lady told me this one's not cooling. I walked up here, I felt cool air. Looked down, and you see these incorrect press fittings. This thing's leaked out pretty good. R410 2019 Goodman. Leave that off until further notice. This one came up. I bet you the motor's cooked, but there you go there. So I don't think the capacitor's gonna do it, but I'll try it. I mean that thing was baking. It spins freely first, too. So you might catch a break today. For now at least. It's just the wire, so. Gotta fix that, but this spins freely. Power's off, low voltage. Here, capacitor here. The wire burned off, didn't even have a chance. Brutal wires too. China. So these have to go in this right orientation. And I remember this wire here because it had the split right here, and this one had the larger split right here. They're so brittle. It really should be replaced. All this stuff. But it is what it is. I mean, look at this thermostat wire. It's crazy. So I have a loaner truck today. I got a brand new truck and it has like 1,500 miles on it and the air condition went, so I'm in a loaner truck. I usually have boxes of wire and don't ask me why I don't today, but I'm gonna cut this and put a new end on it. This is all nice and done. Low voltage here, everything's tight here. We'll get this back to the capacitor. All right, let's go see downstairs. Turn our thermostat. Turn it on. I have the power off up here. I could have just popped the popped the top and pushed the breaker, but I'm not in a rush.
My eyes are going bad. Sounds like crap. Sounds terrible. Hey, you think the chances are of this unit running? For the few minutes we spent are good or bad? Probably should have checked the capacitor before I changed the contactor, huh? Well, no, I know they needed a new one and I know they're gonna need a new fan motor regardless. So let's see if it pops on. Still need a new fan motor. Sounds like trash. It's not so bad. Just that back part was bad. Filter's good. It's, it's cool. A lot of duct work for this little thermometer too, but it's, it's cool and properly. One right here, that this Amana Goodman, that is flat up there on the roof. Um, so they'll have to address that. And then that unit they say is not cool, keeping up, but I mean not cooling, but I think it's just not keeping up because that's not running. Let's see, this guy's cooling. Uh, I'll take my return temp, but he's cooling. He's just like I said, he can't keep up with the other. I'll go check the condenser coil outside too and make sure it's clean. We're removing enough heat. But I mean, you got 60 degrees, dude. Yeah, this thing's cooling properly. Let me see. Some other return. Hey guys, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. That coil outside actually was pretty dirty, so I cleaned it with a hose. Forgot to get a video of it and it's discharging heat nice on that last the last um one that i was taking the temperature but that system's running all on its own pretty much um with that horizontal that's down with the flat with the system that's got the leak but um thank you for watching please like and subscribe have a great day tomorrow's friday enjoy it enjoy every day look at that crack in the window